Hello folks, this is Lord Comet, and this is the continuation of XCOM UFO Defense for the PC. And joining me today is the magnificent, not not to mention uh, ungodly cool, uh, from Twitter, Coin Operated Bear, and known as Mogwai Club, otherwise my good friend and uh, partner in crime today, Mr. James. Thank you so much, sir, for joining us. Hello, 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 hello. So, where are we saving today? We're about to find out in about three seconds. Hmm. Oh yeah, baby. This is where it's going to get interesting. Now that my craft has plasma beams, now it's going to get interesting. Now, because the bigger crafts are going to come out, instead of the little bitty ones, it's going to get brutal. Oh dear. Personal armor, baby. Here we go. I should be researching uh, personal armor, but the alien grenades are so valuable to me as uh, as a uh, chucking item because I don't have to carry those high explosives. It, it just trust me, it's a weight issue. Yes, I mean, you can just never get those on a plane anymore. I'm, I, they always take them in security. Holy smoke. Hold on, I'll have to reload that. An invasion in Hong Kong. Here we go. Hong Kong, eh? Hopefully I have time to go to the market first. Oh, hardy har har. Hey, a boy can help, and if I can help to get some decent bootleg DVDs, I'm all for it. It's a terror mission at night. Uh-oh. This your initial equipment screen, dude. This is where you equip your soldiers. Wow, that's some serious guile hair right there. <laughs> that's the running joke, but yes. There's different kinds of uh, avatars for each character, but guile hair is considered the best. Sonic Boom! This is where it's going to get brutal, people. This is a night terror mission, and these are hard as hell to do. In fact, they're incredibly difficult, and I didn't carry any electro flares with me. So, basically, I'm fighting blind. Night terrors, eh? Cobras! Ha, 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 ha. Alien on the right. Now, see right down here in the corner, it says that little num red number one? Sectoid. Mm-hmm. Ah. See the nice little alien right here in front of the nice house? Oh. Redecorated. You know, I'm going to have to call you next time I repaint my apartment. Um, I mean, seriously, that's just brilliant. <laughs> More sectoid on, uh, inside the bushes. Looks like Rosie's gonna have to take a stab at it. Hmm. She's on the catwalk. Let's see if we can kill this sucker. That's not an alien, that's just a neighborhood cat. That thing was equipped with a heavy plasma, just like we got. That alien came packing heat. You notice the different ranks on the soldiery, which is right down here where my mouse is pointing? That means he is a sergeant. 
Rosa's also a Rosie's also a sergeant, and Comet is the captain. That's awesome. Sergeant Sushomaru sounds like sushi. They're chucking grenades. Sushi, my foot. <laughs> Damn you, kids! Get off my lawn! <laughs> now there's the innocent people going. Oh look, my shop is going down. I can't help it. I excuse the poor, you know, accent there. Hey, maybe they have some flares in the shop, you never know. Redecorating the park. Well... You know, I probably would have gone with a more grass motif, but... Flaming rubble! That, that works, I suppose. I mean, no, no one's gonna hurt themselves on that... Oh, wait. Oh, I killed the alien, too! Heh, <laughs> that's the whole idea behind it. And I redecorated their garden, too! Ain't I nice? Oh, yes, that is lovely. Now, will you please just get rid of that hideous, god-awful kitchen? Oh, look, a cyber disc, dude! Check that out! Think they, these things explode when they, when they die. <laughs> Of course, if she could get, that'd be nice. There it goes! Wow, that's home. some serious stormtrooper syndrome right there. Boom! Kaboom! So yeah. the clouds turn it. So the explosion clouds turn into skulls. Uh, yeah, that neat. Every, yeah, yeah, it's pretty neat. A trick. A trick later put to subtle use in Persona Four. <laughs> You laugh, I'm not kidding. I'm not ju- I, 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 I'm laughing because it's true. Let's see, who else has decided to come invading Hong Kong on my watch? More sectoid. It's shooting the tank. And Comet responds in kind with a shot. He gives a snapple shot. Or, a, or I, call, I call it snapple shot, but it's a snap shot, actually. Oh, Cyberdisk. So this, this let's rip brought to you by Snapple. Ha 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 ha. They don't like my tanks. I mean, the, uh, the AI almost always goes after the tanks because the tanks carry the rockets and they go boom. I haven't heard anybody die. Well, it'd be easy to survive. Mine whammy, look out! Sorry. They're starting to use it. I knew it. Oh crap, what did they do to Rosa? Whoa! I'm guessing something along the lines of a barbecue? Payback is a bitch! Tell me about it. I've got MasterCard knocking at my door. That'll learn ya. Now, who's my whammy and my soldier? We'll find that out next time on with, uh... And the XCOM detail. This is Lord Covet and uh, Coin Operated Bear. We will see you next Coin time. Coin Operated Bear. Have a good night all and God bless.